Too early. Return after dark. Your chariot awaits, fair youth. The good spirits of this tower will guide and protect you. <laughs> Plane. Playing hide and seek. Yeah! Oh! 
playing hide and sit. you what do you want the key to the upper quarters i know you have it you want to free the elven girl your efforts are in vain like an earthling's prophecy the seed has been planted and will soon sprout. shut up and give me the key the key the key uh, where did i put it <laughs> Dress like a whore, behave like one. First I'll plow you, and then I'll slice off your tits. Does that strike your fancy? Cut off your own whore, son! Oh, I love it when bitches bark.
Geralt. We've no time to lose. Geralt? Thanks, Geralt. I heard something behind that door. Don't leave me here. Please. You don't look like a whore, Elf. My name is Mora. What month is it? This is no time to chat. Can you walk? I'll not stay here any longer. Even if I must crawl out. She won't make it through the garden, Geralt. We must leave by the front. Lead the way. We'll be right behind you. I think I... Damn. Her water broke. Geralt, change of plans. But... Back to the tower. I need a clean bed, hot water and some time. We can't be disturbed. Go get help! Warning! Intruder in it! Geralt, I see we're in time. Where have you been, Roach? A little problem along the way. Defeated by a Dwan. I must be getting old. What now? Consider yourself lucky. Though you deserve torture, I lack the means, so I'll simply lop off your head. You'll die a warrior's death. I don't regret a thing. Impending death has addled your mind. I don't regret that it's you. After so many years, it would be stupid to die from an accidental bolt in the eye. Or worse yet, influenza. Damn! Lucky again, your archers approach. I defeated you once, Jorveth, and I can do it again. Remember that. We shall see about that, friend. We shall see. The horseman ran away, but I'm sure he'll show up again. Bloody non-humans. Enough of Jorveth. What's with Laredo, and where's Vess? Laredo's dead. I saved Vess. Barely. What happened? Your plan was hardly the most. A boy, Geralt! A healthy okay. boy! Whose child is that? Morals. Whose? We found an elf woman Lorito kidnapped almost a year ago. He was the father. I'd never touch a she-elf. Enough! We don't have time for that. The ship's waiting.
Why did you do it? Why? Don't touch me! I hate this town. Prepare the boat. We sail immediately. What about the kid? It's not coming with us. And who in this hellhole will take in a half-breed? Saharam. Take it to Saharam in Lobenden. And make sure to tell him it's Morrill's child. The assassin had had his day. Very true. He'd kidnapped Triss Marigold. It seemed like Foltis' life had not been enough. It seemed like the killer also wanted the monarch's former advisor. There was no time to think. It was time to act. Grabbing Geralt, I embarked on a voyage upriver, deeper into the Pontar Valley. There, in a region known as Lormark, King Hensel of Kedwen had made camp with his army. King is the key word here denoting the central figure in my plan to capture the Kingslayer. The special forces of King made the soil light lightly upon him. Foltest had lost some of their customary enthusiasm, treating us to not one single joke of the how many ways can you skin an elf variety, which only goes to support my theory that the human mind is capable of producing a finite amount of horror before some manner of reflection springs itself upon it.